I remember the first song I ever wrote. And the words were, hey you, on the other side of this song, how's it going today? How you getting along? Is your backpack of worries weighing you down? We were never meant to carry it, lay your burdens down. And then it goes on to say, let me walk beside you, come alongside. I promise we are heard every time we cry. So to you on the other side of this guided meditation, I want you to know that I've spent the past few minutes or so envisioning you, seeing you, honoring you, and letting you know from my heart to yours that you are valuable and valued. And I have asked Source to imbue this guided meditation with infinite love and gratitude. So wherever you are right now, whether you're driving the car, doing the laundry, grading papers, paying bills, making dinner, out for a walk, taking a bath, wherever you are right now, know that you have been thought of with great fondness and supreme regard and that you are loved. I hope that you enjoy this guided meditation based upon the words of Louise Hay, all about self-love. Just take a moment to become aware of your breath as it moves in and out of your nostrils. And as you do so, perhaps you would put your hand or hands over your heart space and become aware of the heart chakra, the energies in the heart space, that beautiful portal into the depths of your truest identity as love as source itself and my hope and intention would be and is that as you listen to this and you receive the transmission of love that it would stir you that it would awaken that God spark within you And that you would find yourself remembering who you are as the source, as God. Thank you for your presence here. In the infinity of life where I am, all is perfect, whole and complete. I live in harmony and balance with everyone I know. Deep at the center of my being, there is an infinite well of love. I now allow this love to flow to the surface. It fills my heart. It fills my body. It fills my mind. It fills my consciousness. It fills my very being and it radiates out from me in all directions and returns to me multiplied. The more love I use and give, the more I have to give. 
The supply is endless. The use of love makes me feel good. It is an expression of my inner joy. I love myself. Therefore, I take loving care of my body. I lovingly feed it nourishing foods and beverages. I lovingly groom it and dress it. And my body lovingly responds to me with vibrant health and energy. I love myself, therefore, I provide for myself a comfortable home, one that fills all my needs and is a pleasure to be in. I fill the rooms with the vibration of love so that all who enter, myself included, will feel this love and be nourished by it. I love myself, and therefore, I work at a job I truly enjoy doing, one that uses my creative talents and abilities, working with and for people I love and who love me, and earning a good income. I love myself, therefore, I behave and think in a loving way to all people. For I know that which I give out returns to me, multiplied. I only attract loving people in my world, for they are a mirror of what I am. I love myself, therefore I forgive and totally release the past and all past experiences and I am free. I love myself, therefore, I live totally in the now, experiencing each moment as good and knowing that my future is bright and joyous and secure, for I I'm a beloved child of the universe. And the universe lovingly takes care of me now and forevermore. All is well in my world. Take a moment to come back to that breath, to feel the air moving in and out of your nostrils, to become aware again of the heart space, that portal that goes in and in and in to the depths, the widths, the heights, and the lengths of who you really are as an eternal being having an earthly experience.
perhaps it would be helpful to say aloud these words, I love myself and therefore I allow myself to take proper care of my physical body. I love myself and therefore I give myself permission to take whatever time, to spend whatever money, to take good care of my physical body. I want to be friends with my physical body and so starting now I will be friendly towards my physical form. If I am not yet thankful for this physical body, then I allow myself to be on a journey of becoming friends and becoming ever so grateful for this physical body that I have and that my essence is stored in. It is true that I am awakening to the vitality, to the beauty, and to the splendor that my physical form is. If I have ever thought that my physical form was in any way sinful, then I want to formally apologize to my body and say, I don't think that way anymore. And I am on a journey of remembering that my physical form manifests the glory that I am. I allow myself time to come into a balanced relationship with my physical body, all the parts of my body. My arms and hands, my legs and feet, my hips, my sexual organs, my breasts, my neck, my face, my hair, and the way that my body feels. I am becoming more and more aware that my body has a wisdom and it longs for me to listen to it. I love myself and that includes loving and appreciating my body. And I speak to it now when I say I see you, I hear you, I feel you, and now I am listening to you. As you speak your wisdom to me, I 
I will include you, my body, in on the decisions that I make. I'll make sure to check in with you. When it comes to the things that I choose to do, say, agree to, be around, ingest, I understand now that we are awakening, dear body, together. That consciousness is awakening. The Christ within is awakening. And those energies are being embodied. Those energies and that consciousness is in the body. Alchemizing. Integrating. Transmuting, metamorphosizing, and it is glorious. And so we end our time together, giving our bodies a giant hug as our body says, Welcome home. Dear traveler, I didn't go anywhere. I was waiting for you to awaken to my part in the ascension. We finish our time together acknowledging the energies of infinite love and gratitude. that we pour into this meditation. We hope that you've enjoyed our time together and we encourage you to check out our other guided meditations, the sound bowl healing meditations, written meditations and intuitive messages on our YouTube channel. I am here for one-on-one consultations for spiritual guidance and energy healing. I wish you all the best. Until next time, I love you, and here's a hug.